What if AI could analyze stocks better than the top hedge fund managers? I'm Richard Walker from Lucidate, and in this video, I'll show you what's currently possible with the power of AI agents. Let's jump right into an investing scenario. Lucy is a portfolio manager at a fundamentals driven hedge fund. During a recent market contraction, she's protected the value in her portfolio by being overweight consumer staples, but she feels that the tech tide is turning. It's all about AI. She feels like she'd like to rebalance out of defensives and into growth stocks. And she's further narrowed the choice down to three investments in this space, either Nvidia, Microsoft, or Apple. But how to pick the best one? There are so many financials to weigh, growth rates, margins, multiples. And what about news headlines and analyst ratings? When analyzing a stock, there are a dizzying array of fundamentals to consider. First up is profitability, metrics like gross margin, operating margin, return on assets, and return on equity. These indicate how effectively and efficiently the company is generating profits from its operations. Growth measures. These show how rapidly the company's financials are expanding over time. Moving on, financial health metrics like current ratio and debt to equity ratio assess the stability and soundness of a company's balance sheet. Valuation ratios like price to earnings and price to book compare the stock price to financial factors to see if it's over or undervalued. And finally, there are sentiment measures like analyst ratings and news sentiment. These provide a qualitative perspective on market expectations for the stock. As you can see, there's a complex web of interconnected fundamentals our AI assistant needs to analyze and compare between stocks. Leveraging the powers of machine learning helps cut through the noise and highlight the metrics that matter most for making an informed investing decision aligned to your objectives. The AI doesn't replace human judgment, but it does provide an invaluable perspective and starting point for further research. These agents package the power of big data and algorithms into an easy to use tool. So you spend less time crunching numbers and more time pursuing your financial goals. That's why Lucy turns to cutting edge AI using a lang chain to link specialized agents. They can automate filtering through this fire hose of data. In this video, see these agents in action as they retrieve financial data for each stock, compare growth and profitability ratios, analyze valuation multiples, check recent news and analyst sentiment, and recommend the best stock for Lucy's needs. The AI saves time, provides unbiased insights, and surfaces the trends she could easily miss. But Lucy knows that the bots aren't perfect. She still reviews their output herself before making investment decisions. So here's a demonstration application that allows Lucy to input a general question and have the AI do all the grunt work. She wants to know, given the current state of the market, what is the best tech stock for her portfolio? The AI sifts through the vast sea of information and returns Microsoft as the best recommendation. It may be that Lucy is happy with that summary and proceed, but most likely, she'll want to be more diligent and see how the AI came up with that recommendation. As you can see, there's a huge amount of information. I won't read it word for word, but one of the great things about YouTube is you can pause the video and read as much or as little as you want. With the UI controls on the left, Lucy can do pretty much the same and toggle off parts of the analysis that she isn't interested in. There's a lot of detail as the AI has compared valuation metrics and fundamentals of the stocks it was asked to compare. The AI also shares the plan it formulated to tackle the question, along with some key thoughts, observations, and reflections that Lucy might find insightful. All right, let's understand how all this works. We're going to use multiple language models and multiple tools for fetching up-to-the-minute financial information and news. We don't know 
when we write the program, what questions are going to be posed. So we need these components to be loosely coupled together and wait until runtime to pull them all together based on the questions that Lucy inputs. Each question will be answered in a different way with its own plan and unique set of reasoning and action steps. So for each question, we'll roll up an idiosyncratic configuration of AI models and tools. All of this configuration is handled behind the scenes by Langchain. For this demo, we'll use the plan and execute strategy. As the name suggests, our agent is made up of two components, a planner and an executor. The planner uses an AI model and a prompting technique called chain of thought to figure out a step-by-step -step way to answer the question. Executors use another AI model and a set of specialist tools to get up to the minute information. The executor uses a prompting technique called REACT. REACT stands for reasoning and action. It uses REACT to figure out what questions to ask, what observations to make, and what action to take. The planner and executor are both part of an AI agent. This agent handles all the interaction and dialogue between the planner and the executor, and the agent is ultimately responsible for returning the answer back to Lucy. Let's break it down. For our planner, we start with a large language model. This can be any model you choose or a model of your own design. In this example, we'll use GPT-4 from OpenAI. The model is part of the planner. When the question comes in from the user, the planner will use the AI model to come up with a series of steps to solve the problem. Right out of the box, models like OpenAI's GPT-4, Anthropic's Claude, and Meta's Llama 2 are great at these tasks. But clearly, you can fine-tune or develop a model specifically for this kind of task decomposition, should you wish. Next up is the executor for the React prompting. Firstly, we'll define some tools for the executor to use. Once again, we'll supply an LLM to coordinate all of the observations, thoughts, responses, and actions required at each stage of the plan. And the agent is made up of a planner and an executor. The agent handles all of the natural language dialogue between the planner and the executor. Remember, in these systems, natural language is the interface. It's all about asking questions of large language models. This agent will return the considered result of Lucy's query back to her in the application user interface. Let's look at the other side of rebalancing, which position to sell. Here, Lucy is torn between reducing her position in two consumer staple stocks. Should she reduce her position in Procter & Gamble to fund her Microsoft purchase, or would she be better off selling Coca-Cola? Again, the AI goes to work to make a determination based on current price, news, and fundamentals. In this case, its advice is to sell Coca-Cola. And once again, it provides details, a review of the plan that it concocted to produce this recommendation, as well as further thoughts, observations, and reflections. Again, feel free to pause the video at your leisure to take a deeper dive into the detailed output of the AI and all of its decision-making. So that's the power of AI agents, automating complex financial analysis in seconds versus hours of human work. But blindly following their tips is foolish. Lucy reviews the recommendation, does some sanity checks, and combines it with her own research before investing. The bots enhance, but do not replace human intelligence. With robustness, resilience, and frankly, tirelessness built in, these AI agents provide powerful analytical skills that would be unattainable manually. Lucy uses their output to make smarter, faster investing decisions. So in this video, we saw AI automate collecting and comparing financial data, surface potentially overlooked trends and insights, incorporate news and sentiment, and finally recommend stock rebalancing aligned to investment goals. AI is transforming investing. Want to try out the open source FinBot code yourself? Well, join Lucidate's YouTube membership at the VP 
MD or CEO level to get access to the source code for this demo. Download it, develop it and make it your own. Members at the MD and CEO level, in addition, get access to an exclusive code walkthrough video. Like this demo? Smash that subscribe button for more videos fusing AI and finance. Thanks for watching. This is Richard Walker signing off. Go leverage AI and crush those markets.